Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. This is Zach with Zach Attack Cards, bringing you another exciting football opening as we get closer and closer to draft day. I figured it'd be a good time to take a look back at the year that was and take a look back at some of the some of the better 2023 releases, uh, but also do a little bit of a test here and see, does it matter how many cards you get versus the value, right? So what I mean to say is, right, so you get the most cards with Donruss at 90, you get 66 with Prestige, and then I was able to find a Mosaic pack, which is just 15 cards, but we all know that's a little bit more of a premium stock. So obviously you have less of a chance of hits, 1 in 15 versus, you know, 1 in 90, but, you know, your your hits tend to be on a larger scale, I think, when it comes to Mosaic. Or is that the case? That's that's kind of what we plan to put to the test here today. Because, I mean, Donruss, they can they can come out firing. You can pull your downtowns. And obviously, that's, that's probably going to be better than anything you can get out of the other two. Um, but let's go ahead and dive into it. Let's just have a little bit of fun, talk a little bit of football. There's not a whole lot going on in the world of football. Uh, obviously, all the draft stuff different news there but um you know Aaron Rodgers obviously in the news for different things not really going to get into that but um these are some excellent sets this year I really enjoyed Prestige and Donruss and Mosaic was good too when you could find it obviously at this point Mosaic is a, a definitely more uh, older slash I don't know mature release whatever you want to call it it was one of the Definitely one of the earlier releases for the 2022 uh, set area, whatever you want to call it. So let's go ahead and just get the boxes open. Got some damage boxes, at least in the case of the Prestige. Let's see if that brings us any luck. Like I know it does a lot of you out there. And then we will go from there. And then we have just a single mosaic that we will open last. So, let's kick it off. Let's start with the most. Let's start with Donruss and see if we can get anything. Get our little sorter here to keep track of hits, rookies, base, etc, etc. And let's see if we can get a little luck and get something pretty sweet from Donruss. I believe Optic is due out in the next handful of weeks. Uh, I saw it listed... Um, I think it was Dix that had it on their website already for pre-order. But uh, obviously just a shiny version of Donruss. So we'll have to see what they're, what they're charging. I believe the... Don't, you know, don't, uh, you know, call me a liar or anything like that. But I want to say that the, the fat packs only said they had like 12 cards in them or something like that. So... Uh, I'm not a huge optic buyer, but I feel like that's less than usual. So, not really sure what's going on there. You know, prices just continue to go up as they continue to print more, which is definitely counterintuitive. On to our rookies in the first pack. Joey Porter Jr. and Evan Hull for the Colts. Porter, definitely a good one. Kid Reporter, way out of date by this point. See if we can get him pack number two. And we got ourselves a real nice Will Anderson on the back. We're just going to go ahead and take that right out. Very nice. Defensive Rookie of the Year. Will Anderson Jr. Elite Series Rookies. Let's see if we get a little less glare here. Apologies for that. Trevor Lawrence. A lot of base at this point. These sets have been... Just about done to death, as they say, but I like to try to build the sets, so we'll see once we're all done here. Purdy looks like he's running for his life. And on to the rookies, Clayton Toon kicking it off, and Aiden O'Connell. So two quarterbacks, not necessarily the ones everyone's looking for, one could say. Ooh, got a white hot rookie. That's nice. That's a... I believe a retail exclusive. 
I have to double check on that as well, but I believe it's a retail exclusive. Insert OBJ. CD Lamb. Oh, and here we go. Rookies again. Tyler Steen. Tank Dell. That's a nice one there. And look at that. White or Red Hot Rookie. Oh, apologies. Red Hot Rookie. Jameer Gibbs. Where am I thinking? White Hot Rookie. That must be... Is that a different set, possibly? But very nice on the Jameer Gibbs. 15 cards per pack. And obviously it goes down just a little. And we get to Prestige, which is 11 per pack. And then we have the one fat pack, or value pack of Mosaic, which has 15 cards. Might not be the best way to compare things, but thought it would still make for a pretty fun video. A nice little opening to go through some football. And obviously there's going to be a lot of talk once the draft gets here. Chris Rodriguez Jr. and Deshaun, or maybe Deshaun Johnson. Followed by a rated rookie, Jordan Addison. Ooh, that's nice. Rated rookie, the, um, oh, what do you call it? The, uh, shoot. And you can see it's got the texturing to it. Can't quite recall what it's called, but it's, it's a very nice insert. Rated rookie, some kind of proof. But anyway, I'm not going to waste your time with that. But might be one of the better pulls so far. Unless we can come away with a downtown. Oh, looking like a second Will Anderson. A different card this time. From the rookies. Will Anderson Jr. Very nice. See if he can continue his dominant ways in year two. Or if he has any drop off in his sophomore campaign. Chase Young, I think we saw there. I think he signed with the Saints. And we have Roshan Johnson and Keon White. Last pack of Donruss. Again, Addison and probably the inserts being the best so far. And this one looks like it's going to be a, a base pack. I don't see any insert or anything on the back. There's Aaron Rodgers. Minka, Shaq, and here we go. We have Brian Branch for the Lions. And a production line, Jared Goff. Darius Davis on the press proof. Nice rookie. Production line. Ooh, very, very nice. Is that a more difficult pull, possibly? Oh, just down towards the bottom. Production line. Cosmic, cubic, lava. I'm guessing this is just regular. So I don't see any numbering. Probably would see it on the sides of the front of the card. So, not bad, though. I mean, I'll probably put that with the Addison. And again, with the, the couple nice Will Andersons. And it was, a, it was a very nice box for Donruss. You know, considered one of the lower end. <laughs> Look at that. Basically, appears to be the same picture, just zoomed in and zoomed out. And even the Red Hot Rookie Gibbs is a good one. So, very, very nice. Rookies, I mean, nothing really to write home about there. I'd say uh, Tank Dell, probably the best out of the standard rookies. On to Prestige. We all know Prestige guarantees you a numbered card per... Blaster, so we'll be on the lookout for that. And we kick off with Thurman Thomas Simmons. I, I just I really love the design of these. I really hope that they, you know, don't change very little about these. That was not proper English, but you get what I'm saying. Don't change a lot about these. I think they're awesome the way that they are. You know, maybe maybe make the names a little easier to read. <laughs> Will Anderson Jr. He seems to be my guy. Khalil Herbert. On the extra points, very nice. And the alma maters, there we go. Aiden Hutchison, Mozzie Smith, and Rashawn Gary all went to Michigan. I like those inserts. 
Very nice, fun, and educational, as they say. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I like Prestige this year. Just sharp, you know, white cards, a little different than, you know, darker stuff that a bunch of different sets kind of went to. What do we have here? We have Garrett Williams. Travis ATN on our extra points. And our Any Given Sunday is T-Law. That's a nice card. All by a Junk Kid Reporter. Where will the numbered card be? Let's flip it this way. Oh, I think that's it. Looks like a numbered insert as opposed, as opposed to a numbered parallel, which has been, I want to say, most of the numbered stuff that I've pulled out of Prestige this year. Done a couple of different videos, so if you like Prestige, definitely check them out. Uh, we have Tank Bigsby and Devon Witherspoon. And our numbered card is Jerry Rice Living Legends, 318 of 399. And it's like green because it's extra points, I guess. Interesting. Let's see if that is the numbered card or if there's maybe a bonus. You just never know with this stuff. And it's half the fun. Just never know. It's fun to get some stuff opened. Like I said, I enjoy doing comparison videos and stuff like this. I hope you guys enjoy them too. It's just, it's interesting to see what your money gets you. Paris Johnson Jr. We got Tayshawn Gibson on the extra points. And Tariq Woolen on the For the Record. And we have two packs to go. Finish up with Mosaic. And then make a call. Digs. Ourselves. Okay, apparently these are flipped every which way. Heidi Mahomes. All right, that's a lot of fun, guys. And then Clayton Toon on the rookie, followed by a Mozzie Smith on the extra point. That'll be a rookie as well. Very nice. And another alma maters. Deshaun Watson, Hunter Renfro, and Trevor Lawrence. All came from Clemson. Very nice. Last pack. See if we can get a little last pack magic for prestige. Not seeing anything numbered, so... Looks like the Jerry Rice will be our numbered pull for this box. Jeffrey Simmons, Arakpo, Keyshawn Johnson. You also see guys in this set. You just don't see other in other sets like Brian Arakpo. I don't remember the last time I saw him get a card. Luke Musgrave and oh, Bryce Young. There we go. Shows up at the end in a little surprise. And then a little Saquon Barkley p -p 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 powerhouse. Not bad. Nice insert there. But Jerry Rice being the numbered card. Again, not too impressive with the rookies. The Bryce Young's nice. And other than that, you know, pretty standard. Uh, same with Prestige. You normally get one rookie uh, parallel, which we did with the Mozzie Smith. So last but not least, Mosaic 15 card value pack. Actually had this for a little while, so... Thought it'd be fun to just toss in a video. And here we go. Terrell Davis. Luke Keekley. Tua Tagovailoa. Cameron Jordan. We got Debo Samuel. National Pride of Tyreek Hill. Christian Gonzalez. Nice rookie there. Rasheed Rice, very nice rookie there. Got Adam Thielen, a prism turned over. Just a silver prism from the looks of it, but very nice. We have a green prism, Nick Bosa. And then we have, I think these are pink camo. Joe Montana, Cooper Cup, National Pride. Sean Alexander. And Epic Performers, Joe Burrow, and Touchdown Masters, Justin Herbert. So, not really anything in here. I mean, Rasheed Rice probably being the best card. So, uh, 
I'm going to go ahead and give it to Donruss. I think Donruss had the nicer output with the, you know, the Jordan Addison parallel, the couple Will Andersons, the Jameer Gibbs, production line Jared Goff, which seems to be a, a somewhat difficult pull. Um, and Prestige just had what, like I said, pretty much the one numbered card. I don't think Powerhouse is a super difficult pull. Let's take a quick peek. Not seeing it here. Looks like it's right there. So, you know, maybe 85% down the box, maybe. Uh, it's also hard to tell. I mean, it's are they truly more difficult to pull because they're further down the box? I, I don't know if that's ever necessarily been proven or not. But, uh, yeah, Donruss wins it, I think. You let me know in the comments who you think took this opening and uh, and just which set you enjoyed out of 2023. It doesn't even have to be uh, one of these sets. You know, let me know if uh, maybe Prism was your favorite. Uh, that was definitely a, a, a tough one for me if uh, you've been watching my videos <laughs> for a bit. Um, but yeah, with that said, guys, I'm going to go ahead and get you on out of here. If you could head down below, hit the subscribe button, click the like while you're there. We put out videos every Monday and Friday. And one last thing, thank you guys oh so much for everything. Thanks for, you know, liking the videos, commenting on the videos. Thanks for, thanks for just being truly awesome people. That's, uh, you know, that's really the long and the short of it. Um, it's, it's really cool to see that stuff. It's really cool to interact with you guys and, it's just really cool to be a part of this hobby, interacting with you guys, even in, in person at card shows and stuff like that. It's an absolute blast, and uh, I look forward to what the future holds. But with that said, I'll get Sean out of here. Catch you in the next video. Peace.